Welcome back to Borderlands. In this episode, we'll be heading towards Steel and the Vault, and maybe even finishing the main story for Borderlands. I don't know yet. This is supposed to be where some guardians are, I believe. Yep, there's one of them. Hello there. Now where are you? There you are. Hit fire. There. I'll take it for now, but I probably will end up using it. There's a dead alliance. This'll help. Will it though? Didn't think I was gonna jump far enough. Hey, another alien weapon. Or Iridian weapon. This might hurt. No. Jesus, you hurt. I can't even see high enough to hit you, you bastard. Let's try this again. There we go. One shot. a dead guardian. Damn. It seems like something more like the bandits would do, not Iridians. Or whatever the guardians are, I assume they're a Iridian. Right, this place, which has guardians and lance everywhere. Let's take out the Guardians first, I guess. It's when the electricity procs is when the Sarah Guardians go down in one hit. Any more flying ones? Yes. There we go. And there's still some more flyers. I want to get rid of them. Damn. I need to try to lead where they're going. How the hell did graffiti get all the way up there? <laughs> Goodbye. I saw two remaining flyers, so where's the other one? Hop down. I'll find it when I find it. God damn, it sounds like chaos down there. Oh, that's because it kind of is. This seems like a good spot for my turret. I don't know what it's shooting at right now. Seems like it was shooting at the Guardian. Bye. Down you go. Oh, 
Where are you? Come on, buddy. There we go. I don't see anything else marked on the mini map. Always nice to get resupply. Hmm. You know what? I'll take that actually. It's just more free damage. I don't see why I shouldn't use it. That is a nice looking revolver. I'll take it. Alright, we got guns over here. It's only a one times crow, so if it's not useful. Let's see here. Oh, there are some lights still here. Ow. Jesus. It told us my last warning, then get shot in the ass. What the shit? for them, even if you hit their shield. There you go. I think it still works, if I remember correctly. Just love that I have more than 100% increased magazine size. I was gonna head up there, but I failed to jump. here to the Iridian Promontory. A lot of Iridians here. Your gunfire as well. There's one. Okay, don't rock it. Fine. Be like that. Out. Goddamn, even if you don't get hit by it, your screen still shakes a bit. What are you still shooting at, though? Principal one. Damn, you actually killed it. Impressive. Come on, just turn around and fight me. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Oh, good. Jesus. So many of you. But it's their shield. It really is. This close, I don't need to aim, I can just hit fire. Or not, because apparently, even if it's in my face, hit fire does not hit. 
Do some of the alien weapons use electricity? I don't remember anymore. I think they do. Could switch that out for this rifle. It only has a two times shock, which is worse than Reavers, but it might be fine. It has a very fast fire rate, which means it can proc elements pretty good. Case in point. <sighs> of course it's you. Down you go. That'll work. This seems to be working better for Guardians. His loot's now gone forever. Anyway. care of now. Oh, they're not shooting at me because I wasn't close enough or shooting at them yet. Interesting. One more infantry. This thing doesn't kick at all, what the hell? I'm not even controlling the recoil, it just doesn't move upward. That's kind of nice. So I change class mods, I don't auto-regenerate ammo anymore. So I actually need to pick some up myself. Left someone back here? I don't know where that dude is marked. The compass says it's super far away, so maybe he like fell through the map or something? <laughs> or does this path take me further down? No. You know what? I'm not going to keep looking for him. Not worth it. Hey, buddy. That's a lot of Saras. Nice. into. could do that for a grenade regeneration per minute. That would be better cooldown reduction for my turret, which is 100 seconds. If I get that fully upgraded, it'd be 50 seconds instead. Or maybe I should take more assault rifle, recoil reduction, and magazine size? 
This is some bullet damage resistance. That won't help me. Let's go with this. I could take it, even if it's just to sell later. I thought there was a shop at the beginning of this place, but I must have missed it, or something. Guardians I can see right there. I think that took so many bullets because I wasn't at a optimal range for this game. Oh, hello, badass injury. healing items left. Two left. Conveniently, there's a lot of ammo here. There's another chest up here. I get there's so much loot. Just a solid 100 damage. Probably have a better rifle though. If I wanted to use a non elemental. Oh, hello there. Take out three of them with one mag. Still that one that's marked way back there. <laughs> it's a lot of ammo. Might as well get rid of you now. I'm just gonna keep walking forward while shooting you. Guardian. Damn. This is it. The reason you're here. I've guided you to this point, and you've done so well. Know that you are ready for this. When the vault opens, brace yourself. I believe in you. You can do this. Just gotta fight through an army of guardians. Unless it's just a lance up ahead now. Oh yeah, it is lance now. I 
I'm hoping for an ammo machine up ahead. I could use that. I'll start this fight. They shoot now. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? Oh, there goes my turret. There's the Sarah. Let me hit this Arch Guardian. Can back off. See something moving behind me. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. That's not good. Hmm. Fine, I'll use my sniper then. There we go. I don't think I'm getting more ammo. I guess I could use that so I can regen ammo. You have failed to listen to Commandant Steele. I've warned you time and again, yet you persist on ignoring my orders. The contents of the vault are rightfully the property of the Atlas Corporation. But you? <laughs> you belong to me. Yeah, the key works! Sergeant, get your team ready to go inside. The Destroyer. Don't give up. This creature may be immortal in its own realm, but in this reality, it cannot survive without a host. And that makes it vulnerable. When it becomes flesh and blood, it can be hurt, even killed. You just need to know where to aim. Well, conveniently, I know where to aim, Angel. Thing hurts, though. Yeah, I'm regenerating more ammo than I'm spending right now. I assume the racks are there for if you get downed or something. Ow, but right now they're just a pain in the ass. I think you can also revive from the tentacles if you can destroy them before he pulls them back in. Destroy a parasite. Oh, they're not racks. <laughs> oh. I forgot you can't slide. I've been playing a lot of games where you can slide. Okay, that's it. The parasites need to die. My god. Seems to be a good angle so far. Ow. It's hitting the pillar, but I can still hit Sai. I need to get rid of that other tentacle that throws shit at me. Okay, let's 
throw that out. Help it, sniper. This will do much. Shooting a laser beam, I'm gonna stay away from that. There you go. Nailed it. Almost down, we just passed the E and the going halfway through the H. Almost have my turret back again. It means I've been fighting this thing for almost four minutes. <laughs> Need ammo. I'll kill you with a revolver if I have to. There we go. Hyperion Satellite Angel War 4 and 6 3 1. Damn, Pandora does look like a barren rock. Borderlands. <laughs> it's always good to play through. The main story is a little short, but then again, it came out in, what, I think it was 2009, so maybe that was just the average length of single-player games. It would have been nice to see more of Steel, because the only time we saw her was when she was telling other Lances to kill us, or at the end when she got eaten by the Destroyer, so it would have been nice to see more from her, because she is a Siren. And I'm kind of curious if we've seen her siren ability in any of the other games, or if they've even been mentioned. I don't think we ever have an answer for that, because I think her siren ability is listed as unknown, so we don't know. Gameplay-wise, the game's fine, I think. It's a standard looter shooter, I guess you could say, so you just loot what you need and then use it to get your way through the game. Other than that... I don't think I've missed any side missions, so I think the next thing I'd need to do for Borderlands would be DLC stuff. So I'm going to start with, I think, the Zombie Island of Dr. Ned. I think that was the first one that was released. Yeah, that sounds about right. I don't know why the Interplanetary Ninja Assassin Claptrap was shown at the end of the game, though. Because that was the fourth DLC, unless they just showed it as a teaser and it just took a while to figure out what they wanted to do with Claptrap. Anyway, I think that's pretty much all I want to say about Borderlands at the moment. So I'm going to let the credits play out, and yeah.
Alright, and the credits are done. Also, I forget there's like seven chests at the end of this. And I guess we still have one more thing to finish Armament. before the game is fully completed, which is returning the key to Tannis. Um, take what I can. But I might be close to filling up my inventory. <laughs> and none of these are better than my shield, of course. Oh, hey, a gearbox sniper. Nice. Iridium. It's fine, I can just use one and pick up another. Never mind, I guess I can't use that one. Even though I'm pretty sure you can get to like level 6 for the elemental effects. Seriously? I thought vending machine showed up here later. Huh. Maybe I have to leave this area and come back for that? Might as well toss this out then, and then be able to pick up another purple weapon. Which I might end up selling or something, I don't know. Anything else I'd want here? Not really. I'll pick up all the ammo though. Actually, I want to pick up that other one. I'm mildly intrigued with it. What do I want to get rid of, though? All of these weapons are different. Do the same weapon here? No, one of them is a contact grenade, which I probably don't need if I have a rain one. Anyway, let's head over to Tannis now, because I need to do that. You're from off planet. You smell oddly. Well, that's going to be the end of this episode. Tomorrow I'll be starting the Zombie Island of Dr. Ned DLC. But anyway, until next time.